this mama had babies last night. Unfortunately, something happened and one of them was on the grate and then the other ones were sitting out here in the cold. So I got them all in the back and I'm gonna take them inside and put them under some heat. They were all alive, but they were really cold. So let's try to get some heat under them and see if we can't uh, revive them, so to speak. So we're gonna go ahead and put a heating pad with some t-shirts and a towel. And then we're gonna attach, as you can see, the heating lamp. Get them under some heat. So we got everything plugged in. This one right here is super cold. He's still moving, so that's good, but he is cold, cold. It looks like the light and the heat is getting him moving a little bit. But he has his mouth fully open. He's taking those deep breaths, so I hope he uh, hope he makes it. So we're just going to cover everybody up, and time will tell. So unfortunately, we did lose one, but we were able to save the rest. After an hour of warming up, they are ready to go back into their nesting vault box. I took some of mom's hair and I put it in there and I put all fresh hay. So the kids are back in the nesting box, which is back in the cage with mom. Got mom a handful of sunflowers and we'll see what happens in 24 hours. So quick 24 hour update. You can see they're doing just fine. Yeah, they're all they're all doing good. I don't feel anybody cold. They're kicking. Yeah, they're doing a lot better. So just a couple of quick tips here. As you can see, that's how I like to warm the rabbits up using either a heating pad or a brooder, brooder light for your chickens or both as an idea in this situation because I knew that they were cold. Um, pretty cold and I wanted to get them under heat as quickly as possible um, so yeah keep that in mind I knew that my doe was gonna have rabbits soon that's why she had the nesting box in there I knew it was gonna be any day and rabbits usually give birth pretty early in the morning my does tend to give birth around 4 a.m. so by the time I got there they were already on the wire for a couple hours and so it's just important to note if you notice that you have rabbits that are on the wire or they're not fully in the nesting box um, pretty good chance if it's you know still during your cold season that you know they're pretty cold and have a very high chance of uh, of dying if immediate action isn't taken so if you do encounter this situation don't panic you know put them in the nesting box and then immediately take them inside and try to warm them up like I said most of the time I, I have pretty good results you know, losing one is unfortunate, but, you know, it could have been a lot worse if, you know, I had gotten there later and didn't take appropriate action. So, you know, it's a part of, you know, owning, owning animals and livestock. You know, nature will take its course at times, but that doesn't mean that you can't do everything in your power to make sure that you give them the best fighting chance. So there you have it. I hope you guys learned something from the video. Leave any comments or questions in the comment section below. And as always, guys, long live the Republic.